Thank you, Mom and Dad, for giving me the opportunity when I was young to compete in a sport like you kayak. You always sacrifice a lot, whether it was leaving work early to drive me to practice or taking a whole day off to take me to a regatta. Um, I always appreciated your support. Um, so thank you. Thank you both for being my biggest supporters on and off the field in everything that I do. Mom, thank you for being the most enthusiastic and crazy fan in the stands. And Dad, thank you for always pushing me to be my very best. You guys give me the best hugs after the games, regardless of my performance, and it means so much to me. Love you both. I'm so thankful for how courageous you both are and continue to be um, from leaving your homes um, in the Congo to come to Canada for a better life, not knowing what that would look like. And um, you guys are the true definition of knowing what it's like to be uncomfortable, um, but staying comfortable within that. And um, it's beautiful. You guys are great. You guys are my rocks and I love you. them. I don't know why this moment sticks in my mind and in the grand scheme of things, it wasn't a huge moment, but to me it was special. Uh, when I did my graduation ceremony in high school and I was walking down um, to the back of the auditorium and in the crowd I spotted my dad and I just ran to him and gave him a huge hug and that sort of is symbolic of our relationship. He'll always have me and he'll always be ready to give me a hug whenever I need it through the highs and lows. So always grateful for my parents for that reason that they're always there. Thank you for all the sacrifices that you made to take me to fencing competitions almost every weekend, for taking me to practice every day, and for making sure that I had fun at every competition. It wasn't just about going for the competition, but it was about having a good time as well. I'm so thankful for the conversation we had back in 2016 um, and you guys supporting me through my decision of training full time as an athlete. I know that I would not be able to pursue this Olympic dream without all of your love and support um, for me and I'm so grateful for that and um, I love you guys. Thank you for being my biggest fan, my number one supporter, always bringing me to the basketball gym, to practices, uh, to games. Thank you for coming early before school and rebounding for me. Uh, you made me the person I am today and Thank you for always allowing me to follow my dreams. I just want to thank you for your unconditional support and always doing everything in your power to help me and all the little things, whether it's driving over 120 kilometers a day and I would just swing by home and you would have dinner ready for me and I would eat it on the car on the way to practice. I will never ever, I can never express how grateful I am for you and for allowing me to be where I am because there's no way I'd be here without you. So thank you. Thank you so much for always making sure I could get to my swim practices. I know it was a lot of time in the car, a lot of weekends spent at pools, and a lot of coordinating on your part. I'm so grateful for all the time that I got to spend with you on those drives to practice and all those early mornings. Thank you. Thank you for being my rock and my greatest supporter. Thank you for coming to every single one of my competitions. I'm forever grateful for all the memories we have traveling together. But most of all, thank you for always believing in me and believing in my dreams. Thank you for doing everything you could to help me reach those dreams. I wouldn't be where I am without you. 